Good afternoon and welcome to our KRQE.com webcast. I'm Mike Powers. Let's start with Kristen Van Dyke and that forecast. Good afternoon. We're seeing plenty of sunshine around most of the state. Still some lingering cloud cover, though, over the Sacramento's and into the southeast, where we may still see a flurry or two of snow. Temperatures overall starting to warm up a little bit. Temps today will remain below freezing across the state, but we will see better conditions as we head into tomorrow, with most of you making it above the freezing mark. And it won't be nearly as cold tomorrow morning either. Instead of starting out below zero, we're going to start off at 10 degrees tomorrow morning for the metro area, 37 tomorrow afternoon, with a few clouds around, and then over the weekend, feeling very nice. Highs will be in the mid 40s. We'll see a small chance for a little snow on Monday, then colder again by Tuesday with highs around 38. Bitter cold is the big story around New Mexico. Albuquerque's Emergency Operations Center is open and they could be busy there. The most pressing problem in the area is the heat or lack of it. Some areas of New Mexico are running out of natural gas and that includes pockets in Albuquerque. If you have problems in the city, call 311, but you are encouraged to check on neighbors, put on a sweater and Turn the thermostat down 10 degrees. A Farmington father's guilty plea for sexually assaulting his foster daughter means the girl will not have to testify in court. 46-year-old Todd Mortensen pleaded guilty yesterday to three counts of criminal sexual contact of a minor. The now 13-year-old victim videotaped the assault. Mortensen faces up to 45 years in prison. He had faced 85 counts of sexual abuse to another foster daughter, but those charges were dismissed in 2004. Stay with KRQE for more news and weather updates throughout the day.